Howdy, your trick guide Reese here. I'm here to proudly present to you our 11th summit of our summer tricks videos. In this one here, I'm going to be showing you 16 tricks that you could do that's right and fit for going on an adventure on a safari. So come on, do the safari with me. And let's get into these 16 tricks from here. From here, what we're going to is make a way to one in the park benches from here. You guys can check out the scenery. Look out back here. Very, very nice. Very, very, very uh, green. So what do we have on the tour? Well, as it is, I'm about to read off our first thing on the tour from here. First, let's get to the, the ground of it and to the rocks. And coming in to the first one, which I like to call the Magic Rock Turtle Trick. Here's what this will look like. So here I am sitting on the ground right next to some rocks. You guys can take a look. Down here, on the side of me, appears to be a rock. Come close. Okay, so just to pick up this, this rock here. As you can see right here, this rock, watch this place in my hand like this, watch. By magic, I get a turtle from the rock of it. So how to get the turtle from this rock? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing is a toy-like turtle into an egg. The egg in itself looks like the right color of a rock. Once you turn it upside down, just like this. All I gotta do is I'm gonna place that into where the rocks are. That way it becomes one with the rocks, just like this. So here's the rocks I'm here I'm going to do is turn like that and I'll place it down where the rocks are, just right here. You can see, just right there, that I'm pointing at, right there. What's going to do, do is going to pick this up, up but be, be careful not to show the turtle come up like this, holding on to this, which will be like the rock. All you got to do is to put it into your hand like this and cover it like this. Give it a cover and simply move it like that. And by magic, get a turtle from a rock, as you can see, just right here. And there includes your turtles of summer with this one. And that right there is how you do the magic rock turtle trick. Bring us way directly from the heart of the woods. We get to our second trick from here. Which is a trick I like to call the magic summer growing weevil bug. Magic trick. Is what this will look like. You can see this weevil bug right here that sits on the um the leaves of the uh twig right here. How about if we actually grow it in size? Check this out. If we just take this off very carefully. Watch. By magic, it grows in size. How is this one done? As is, I'm about to reveal the safari secret to you right now. All you'll be needing are just two things for this. One, you'll be needing is a smaller weevil bug that looks like this and a larger one. As you can see, just right here. You can see that this is kind of light. So is this. As you can see, just right here. What you want to do is place your um, thick little uh, weevil bug and place it on one of the leaves that's right here. Just like that. Well, I'm going to have a camera now so you guys can get see. So from here. Make sure that you have this weevil bug palmed like this and closest to you. Make sure this is not get exposed by simply holding it like this. Picking this up very carefully, like that. Okay, we're gonna do a real bug. What's gonna do is gonna actually uh, throw this down as you cast a hand closest to here like this. 
be very, very quick, and by magic, growing the weevil bug in size. In the palm of your hand, you see, just right here. There it gets your bugs within this one, the bugs of, su uh, of summer. And that right there is how you do the summer magic growing weevil bug magic trick. Bring us down from this tree to our number three. And that is the Happy Summer's Day Zebra Button. Trick gag. Here's what this zebra button will look like. You can see I got this little button here. And next you just give this a little press. Ah! <laughs> Looks like it was a, a it'd be a call for a zebra. So that's this we got a zebra on the tour. <laughs> How's this one done? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing for this are just two things for this. Here are your two ups. And that's what you'll see here. A zebra puppet finger, as you can see, just right here. And then you'll be needing is the zebra button. This actually squeaks. <laughs> Creating the gag within this one too. All you gotta do is simply pop your um, um, finger zebra onto your thumb and hide behind the button just like this. All you gotta do is gonna squeak the button and then pop this up like this. And then just move the head like that. So it's like the, uh, the, the uh, collar for his, the zebra. Exactly. All you gotta do is go. And then boop. Up pops the zebra. And then you can just make the head move from side to side. Looking right at ya. <laughs> Very cute. Cool one you could do for her. the summertime. This involves the safari zebra. Up close. And just done. Pull this down. Take it off your finger. Hide it behind here. And just simply put it down into your lap or palm it and put it into your pocket. From there, take a look, a look at the button from back and front. Makes a really cool trick gig that you could do for the summertime. Very easy and very self working. What else you have on, the to uh, on the, our tour? As is, I'm going to take you to our fourth sp uh, spot from here. And that is the magic happy butterfly patch trick. Here's a this butterfly patch will look like. Oh, look at this. We got a butterfly on a patch. Whoa. Now is that? It's giving us a light show. Let's look at the magic coming off the butterfly. Wow. So how did I get this butterfly to do this? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing are just a few simple things for this one. One is an LED butterfly. You can see right here, it has a little switch, so you turn just like that. It has LEDs built on the inside, makes the wings go, and it makes the butterfly body glow as well too. Then you be needing real or fake flower and leaves, tip them together or glue them together to make the patch, as you see right here. Simply hold it like this into your palm, and you're holding it just like this. All you gotta do is you're gonna flick the switch as you sew the butterfly and simply go like that. And by magic, it gives a summer, a, a summer color show, as you can see, just right here. The wings start to give color. The body a little bit how brings out the color. Make sure you find a shady spot in the woods or wherever you are and make some magic with this. There, it gets your butterfly within this one. And with that, it definitely does give the colors of summer with that one. 
They're making like feathers, and we're gonna get down to our trick number five. What is the trick I like to call? The magic summer bird and feathers magic trick. Here's what these bird and feathers will look like. So here, I got my bird feathers just right here. And now with these, we can make some magic happen. I just love how birds sing as it is to see a bird right here. How about we just step away from this and with those feathers, let's make this bird come to us by those bird feathers. Come follow me, I'll get back at the park bench. Okay, see here? Watch. By magic with the feathers, I make it come to me by magic. So how did I do this? As it is a book reveal, the secret behind this to you right now. All you've been eating is some bird feathers or craft bird feathers. As you can see, just right here. Danny be needing of this two decoration birds. So here is one. Where is the second one? Come follow me. I'll show you where the second one is. It's just perched up just here. So you're gonna actually put one of the birds and perch it up onto a tree. That way it gives us a nice um, place for that. What you're going to do with this is going to hide this with those bird feathers that you've seen. Like this. I got feathers right here. Make sure to show you you have um, a feather fan like that. And just hide the bird behind of it. Just so again, holding on to the tail like that. Make sure the bird is not to be seen. Make sure it looks just like this. That way you get the perched bird, which is uh, just right here. So see? Okay, so what's gonna do is it's gonna whistle like, like that as you approach. That way you get that nice um, bird song inside there. And then simply make your way to a park bench to bring this bird to us by the use of the bird feathers we see right here. So come follow me. Let's go back to the park bench from here. So what you're going to do is you're going to get your hand at the ready, place a bird in like this, and move the feathers like that. By magic, the bird comes to you by the use of bird feathers. You see. Just right here. Now these birds have these on so you can easily put that on to one of the twigs of a tree. That way you can easily sip upon there and perch. Just let us know. These come into a set of two. Just let us know. You can find these in your uh, local bucket too or where they sell decoration nature. There it gets your birds involved with this one. There we go. Just had to readjust that. <laughs> and that right there is how you do the magic summer bird and feathers magic trick. Bring us way down to our trick number six. And that is the summer magic rock sleeve turtles magic trick. Here's what this will. You got that right. Look like. So here I got my nice camel sleeve and I got these rocks here. You guys can see the rocks. I just place them in the inside of the pouch. Like that. Okay, I'm just gonna take that right now. I'm gonna actually just by magic is um take that. I'm gonna dump them out to my hand. By magic, they turn it into turtles. From rocks to trails by the use of this sleeve. How's this, this one done? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing are two small turtles, you see, just here. Then you need a camo sleeve, you see, just here. It looks nice and na nature like. 
then you'll be needing our two rocks. You see, that's it here. The same size as the turtles. So you can see, just it here. What you want to do is you're going to preload your turtles in the inside of this sleeve, just like this. Like that. And then just pull it like this. That way it's open. You can hold it like this. Why? Because what you want to do is. There, I'll go, yes. Like this. What I'm going to do is going to go in and put it into your palm. That way it creates the illusion that you're putting in the rocks into the sleeve like this. If I open, tilt, and simply put it in just like that. These now, you palm them into your hand. And then simply bring this forward as you get these a ditch into your pocket like that. All you gotta do is take the sleeve and just dump the rocks out. And by magic, they change into turtles. As you see, just here in a palm of my hand, by the use of a nature sleeve, you see, just here. And that right there is how you do the Summer Magic Rock Sleeve Turtles Magic Trick. Bring us down to trick number seven here on our 11th and summit. And again, thank you guys so much for watching our stomachs one through ten. Coming up. Very soon, we're getting into our last installment. Just let us know, our last installment is at 12. 12. It's going to be a two-parter because we've got some a very amazing, epic tricks, pranks, and gigs, and magic within the one. Just let us know. With that said, let's get down to our trick seven, which I like to call the Magic White Summer Dove Feathers Magic Trick. Here's what this will look like. Okay, so here I got my... Uh, Nice white dove feathers. Watch this, it is. Take this. By magic, I make a duck appear on it. How is this one done? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing is a wood duck. See, just a hair. And then you'll need is some dove feathers on a string, like this. All you gotta do. Is it going to take one and hide the duck? Just it here. And then has the other one as a pad to make it appear, hold steady, place there, and simply brush down like this, making that duck appear. Like this. So, so the uh, the feather and simply by magic, making a duck appear by the use of white dove feathers. The dove of love for everyone, which I share from my heart to you. There, it brings the summer 11 your direction. Not just that, also, I'm showing my light to you out there as well. Let's welcome in the sun to show the nice warm light. You got that right. Sunshine and blue skies to you with love. Not a stat. I have you all in my thoughts and in my prayers. My prayers go out to you. Because I love you guys so much. That's why I'm going to be making a special. The two parts. The two parts. So please stay tuned for that. Okay, with that said, let's go on with the rest of our tour. I'm here. So what is our next one on the tour, as it is, is to our trick number eight, which I like to call the Magic Summer Jurassic Tour tour Boat Trick. And so this Jurassic Tour Boat will boat like. Oh, hey, this is a tour boat. What did all the uh, people, where did they go? What are what, what, what they so afraid of? Oh! Oh my goodness. Maybe that's what they're afraid of. That that was falling along with them. Oh boy. Okay, yeah. I think I should call for some help. Hello? Hello? 
um, can you get a search party going on? Uh, we had um, um, a, a few um, people just jump out due to um, um, a dinosaur. Can you please come and, and uh, tell me? Thank you so much. Much, much appreciated. I got you. You've been pranked with this one. How is this one done? As it is, I'm about to reveal. Let's get to you right now. I'll be for this. I'll just two things. Or this one. Here are your tulips. What you'll be needing. First up, you'll be needing your cell phone. Why? Because I want to pull the prank even more forward. Then you'll be needing is a tour boat that looks just like this, basically. And of course, what you'll need is a dinosaur. Of course, can't forget the dinosaurs on the tour. It brings the excitement. Exactly. Like Jurassic Park. As is, there's a new one coming out, guys. Um, I forget why it is, but it is coming out in probably, not this year, but next year in the year of 2021. I'll keep it posted with that one as well, too. Just wanted to let you know. But anyways, Harris had to pull this off. All you gotta do is simply hide the dinosaur behind the boat like that. Make sure it does not get seen. And only the, the boat is to be seen with no, no one in the inside. Bring it up. And all you gotta do is simply lift the tail up like that, rising above. But m making sure that you're saying, where did all the people go from the boat? Where did they go? Look shocked. And then, get a dinosaur coming up behind them like this. And like, maybe that's why they ran away. And then, all you gotta do is ditch this into your pocket very quickly. And then get all frazzled. Ah, I think I better call for some help. Oh boy, you got some people jump, jump, jump ship. They're scared. Of, they're scared. Hello, can you please give me some help here? We got a few um, boat escapees. Been scared. Probably that they have seen a dinosaur. Can you please come and bring a search party? They're gonna believe ya. And then I got you got swim your phone and put your finger and say you've been pranked. Cool what I could do is it involves the tour boat and a dinosaur like this one. So there it gets your your trick gag within the prank as well too. I'm making it a really cool one I could do this summer. And that right there is how you do the Magic Summer Jurassic Tour Boat Trick gag prank. You can put that as a gag prank because you're going to put it into a gag and you're going to use a phone to make it the prank. Exactly. Goal one, I fully recommend it. Since we had a boat, how about we get a tour bus that would take you to our next exhibit on the tour. What exhibit number? Exhibit number nine. That is the Summer Jamaican Tour Bus Mazda Trick. It's a this will tour bus like. Now, let's make the way to wheels and we will way in to this one. And here we get a rhinoceros in this one. Cool. Okay, so here's my Jamaican, my Jamaican bus. You can see? This is just gonna just place it in the, on just right here. Just like that, it's gonna just, just, just place it just behind of it, just like that. What you're gonna do is you're gonna actually is just move that side, knowing that the hippo is just right behind here. Watch, watch this. I pick it up, and by magic, could completely make it vanish. As you can see, just right here, completely vanished. Now it's looking welcome back in place, and simply watch. So just pick it up. I just do this, and I make it up here. How is this Jamaican tour bus done? As it is about to reveal the secret. And that is a Jamaican bus. It actually is a serviette holder. You're gonna make sure that you get some um, um, black craft sheet and cover this. So that way, this is on. Um, give out any lighting or any of this from the rhino or whatever uh, toy um, ammo that you have. 
So we're gonna put that side just like this. What you're gonna do is take your rhino and walk it forward. Boop, like that. There's contestant, the rhino contestant. All you gotta do is simply, it's just as you put it behind, you're gonna actually put it into here instead. And simply pick it up and move it like this to create the vanish. Make sure this does not get exposed. Have it like that. After that's done, wheel it back like that. And simply just pull it out like this. So from here, pull up like that and by magic, make the rhino appear from the Jamaican tour bus, you see, just right here. So what you could do, because it involves the tour bus and a summer rhinoceros, as you see, just right here. And that right there is how you do the summer Jamaican tour bus magic trick. Bring us way down to our trick number 10. And that is the magic summer bird egg magic trick. Here's what this summer bird egg will egg like. You can see I got this egg here, and I got this. I'm going to do this again to hold it in the hand just from here. Watch this, 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 this. take that. Watch, you can actually take the egg. And it goes into a bird. How is this one done? As it is about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing for this are just three things for this. A nice covering, yellow or green. Here I'm using the green for the bandana and using this for the covering. All you'll be needing is um, a nice island, island looking like bird, you can see just right here. Then you'll be needing is one of your craft eggs from your Easter supplies. Or a real egg. Be careful when using a real egg for this one. So okay, so here's your egg. All I gotta do is um, get the bird in here just like this as a covering. And put it into your jacket like that. That way it goes into the, the covering too. That way you, you, you'll, you'll get the egg. Go in, and gonna do is gonna drop the egg and go into your, your thing here, like this. And then, you know, doing that. By magic, the egg turns into a bird. Just done. Get your covering and place the bird on top, and present. And that right there is how you do the Magic Summer Bird Egg Magic Trick. Bring us down to our trick number 11, and that is the Magic Summer Magic Safari Jeep Magic Trick Egg. Here's what this will look like. So here, I got a lion, and I got my my Jeep to see just here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place this little lion uh, probably somewhere in the hedge. Where? Let's go find out. Let's go and put this into the hedge, and then let's go sightseeing for a good hedge. Ah, this is a perfect one. In the long grass, it likes that. So let's place this. In here just like that so it's gonna go right down here so you can see where it is guys can take a look it's just right down there okay so now we're gonna go far away and what will happen next you will find out okay so you, you just me put that there we're gonna actually come in put this in the park oh <gasps> All the way from the long grass and the puss behind them. I hope they are very careful. Let's hope they stay inside here this time. I do not want to have um, more um, more jumpies. <laughs> How's this one done? As is about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing is a finger puppet, lion, a jeep that goes with it. Let's see, just here. And then you'll be needing is a big stuffed lion. 
Come on, follow me, and I'll show you where the subtle line is. Just over here. In the long grass, where lions like to be. So what we're gonna do do is gonna place a finger, finger puppet into your pocket of your shirt or pants. Boop. Let's say that before starting. Get your jeep. Then get your uh, stuffed lion. And you're gonna put this into the uh, hedge right here, where the tall grass is. Just like this. So just simply just place the uh, line here and simply just put it into the long grass just like that. As you can see, just right here. I'll close at it first before we carry on. Just right there. Okay, so there is where it is. All I gotta do is get everyone away from where you put it and go at a long di 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 distance with the Jeep. So at a good safe distance, I'm over here, by some place else, you're gonna actually is just to simply move this in, collect at a slant, put this onto your thumb, down into your side, then park this close like this, and then bring the Jeep into park. I'm here gonna actually is a slip your finger up like that and pick it over not too far. Like this. And by magic, the lion that you put a ways away comes to the Jeep. As you see, Jesse here can bring him above his head. And they want to play on it like, I hope they don't know that the lion is just behind the tour Jeep. As you see, just right here. I hope they don't jump. <laughs> exactly. Cool one you could do for summer because it involves the lion. Can't forget the lion on tour because that is a majestic of the tour. Exactly. And there brings the safari with that one. And that right there is how you do the Magic Summer Magic Safari Jeep. Magic Trick Gag. You also put that into a prank as well too. Here we can't forget the uh, the uh, tiger in this one because that's not the main attraction and coming into our Trick number 13. No, I took 12. Hmm. I think I just got, uh, got myself into a mirage. I, does it matter? That's why I brought my water with me. Yeah. That mirage I just seen just there had me a little thirsty. A little delirious. I'll be okay though. Mm. That hit the spot. Okay, that oh, uh, opened me up a little bit, bit more there as it is. Let's look into our 12th trick, which I like to call the Magic Summer Safari Tiger Trick. This is what this will look like. I want to put in the long grass. <laughs> it's pointing at you for the long grass. Do you have anything to say? Yes, I know. What do you have to say? I'll be having a happy and safe summer. You ain't talk to you. How is this one done? It's a very cute one. Get these two this done right now. All you'll need is a hand puppet tiger. Definitely a great one for the safari. Exactly. <laughs> what you want to do is go into the long grass for this, where they like to be as well too. All you gotta do is simply just hide your arm into the long grass like this. Make sure that your arm is bent like this. So they don't get to see it. Have this down more further like that. And then simply just go it up like this. And wave. And then do a little ventriloquism as you talk to it. like. Hey, what do you want to say to the viewers out there? Uh, hi, sir, and a safe home. Like that. Do a little bit of, bit of band with a quizm as you're doing this. Well, definitely um, go well with this. 
Go on, you can do for the kids of all ages, as well as adults too, that just want to have great summer fun with that one. And that there is definitely going to go do on the tour. The safari tour. Because it involves the tiger of it. So I hope you are enjoying the tour so far. As it is, we got it is four more on the tour. So anyways, let's open the door to our last fortress on here. One thing is on the tour, we've got a sloth. Where? I don't know where, but we'll find out. Coming into our trick number 13. Now it's the summer tree sloth prank. Is what this tree sloth will look like. Now, let's go sightseeing for this sloth that should be around here. Come follow me. Okay, you can see here. You got this, you got this tree here. I wonder if um, a sloth will come join us. Aww. It's hugging me. Do you see that? Isn't that cute? Oh. Aww. <laughs> that is so sweet. A saw just came to hug me and then give me a nice little cheek rub there. I got you. You've been pranked. How is this one done? It is about to reveal the secret. All you'll be needing for this is only one thing. Here's what you're going to need for this one. First thing you'll be needing is a tall tree. You see, just right here. That is the first one. Then we can get to our second one. That goes into the hand of it. The hand of the sloth. And that is what you'll see right here. It actually is a, um, um, a sloth, like claw. It is a covering for your arm. You can see right here. And it looks like this. All you gotta do is simply go behind a tree with your arm pressed up against it like this. Like this. So that way, it's like this. Make sure your, your arm here does not get exposed. Only this goes out a little bit like this behind the tree and then simply doing this. So it's like this, reaching out, and then it's only grabbing you like this, hugging, hugging you like this, and doing this on your face very gently. Make sure you find the biggest uh, a tree for this, that way it hides almost everything, as you can see, just here. All you gotta do is simply just do this, hide, and then just go like this. Have it to hug you, like that. Get the pat it, and it pats like that. By magic, a sloth comes to visit you and gives you a hug. Because they definitely love hugs, and so do I. And hopefully you guys like hugging too, because I definitely love hugging. Always hugging and loving, exactly. That's what you can do, because it involves the sloth. And that right there is how you do the summer tree sloth prank. There we get directly down to our trick number 14, and that is the magic safari leopard sheet prank gag. Here's what this will look like. See here, I got my uh, my uh, leopard sheet. Whoa. Ugh. <laughs> what comes out of it happens to be a snake snaking away from the leopard sheet. How's this one done? As it is, I'm about to reveal the secret. All you need is a wooden snake. You can see Jesse here. There it gets the snakes involved with this one. Then you'll be needing is a leopard sheet. This is not a real one, just to let you know. It looks like one, but it's not. It's a fake one. All you gotta do is simply. Um, use your little uh, wooden snake, going behind it like that, and hold like this. And you're gonna do is you're gonna show the leopard um, seat and simply open it up, and the head will come out like this. 
and by magic, a snake comes out of the leopard sheet, um, snaking its way right towards you. What are you gonna do? Because it involves the snake and something a little safari like, as you can see, on top of it. Very easy, and very easy, easy to do, and very easy to pull. And that there is how you do the magic safari leopard sheet prank gag. Can't forget the Jurassic. Because that in it too is a tour as well too. We got something on that tour. Very special. And that is to our 15th one, which the trick I had to call the Jurassic Summer Woods prank. Here's what this Jurassic Woods will look like. I heard in the woods, we have a dinosaur. Let's go checking. Let's be very careful, please. I wonder if it may over here. Is that a dinosaur right next to me? Whoa, seriously, I saw a dinosaur. Did you guys see that? A dinosaur just came up right beside me. Whoa, let's see if we go further in, we'll see if um, even more dinosaurs come. You never know. As it is, I did mention about Jurassic Park, Jurassic World like thing, like that, and I never knew that was actually here in the woods. Let's just say, let's definitely call this one uh, dr Jurassic Woods, because as it was, I think think we all both saw that dinosaur. I certainly did. That gave me a startle. Oh. Why is that tree moving? Whoa, jeez. Okay, I didn't see that one coming. I just got here. And then that ap appeared. I got to. You've been pranked. How's this one done? As is, I'm about to re reveal the secret. Are you been eating? It's just one thing for this. That is what you're going to be seeing here. And that is the official um, Dilophosaurus from Jurassic Park. This has actually been inspired by the film Jurassic Park, making this very special just for you. All you gotta do is simply put on just like this and Hide it, go through a few uh, bushes, and you're gonna simply just, just do this. That's all that's it, and that's all that you are doing. You're gonna act on it as you would to see a real dinosaur right next to you. Make sure you go with the uh, trees, or do that same thing as a sloth hand, and just simply play along with that as well, too. That way, you get everyone involved with this. So, hide and away. Did they, did they too get a surprise with this? And now we do so you do there's a Jurassic Woods prank. Then to our last one we have to our 16th one, the Magic Summer Straw Hat Egg Magic Trick. Here's what this will look like. Got my egg. Paste it in my hat and just like that. Watch, this just go in. Watch. A magic, I get a turtle. How's this one done? I'll switch this right now. All I need is a straw hat, an egg. And a stuffed turtle. I'm going to just place it in the inside just like this. Hold up like this and place it in the inside. Hold tightly on the egg and simply pull out the turtle from it. There's the egg. I'll show you what this is. This egg comes from a pack. It is a sea creature egg and it says a turtle on it. And here you get your turtle with it as little two. That way you'll get this to go with the turtle. So here's a package. Then there's pictures on the back of it. It's a construction looking thing you see in the back of it, just like that. So just preload the turtle in. Hold, it goes in. Hold carefully. And then simply just do this. That's all I was doing. And there you go, all your 16 tricks that you could do for the summertime. I'll see you all back for our last installment going into two, part two. And then after it, coming after it, will be part one, bringing us to part one and part two on our last installment, coming directly soon. There, we've seen lots of amazing epic tricks like that one. This is your host, Reese here. 
Wishing you all a happy rest and a safe rest of your September. I'll see you all soon for our last installment. Peace out. Love you. From the heart. Now, I'll show you something.